Second race of the afternoon is the Royal Calcutta Turf Club Cup Division 1 to be run over 6 for long in Category 3 for horses 4 year olds and upward rated 20 to 45. Number 1 is Castle Rock. Started well this season on a winning note. Winning race number 10, 6 for long trip, beating all time legend by 1.5 length. Took a penalty of 8 points, but particularly in this run, warmed up very late according to me, but managed to be on the board behind blink of an eye. Number 2 is Amira. In pursuit of the leader, Amira, City of Bliss was the eventual winner, who, whereas Amira followed City of Bliss everywhere where it went in the straight, but still next separated these two at the post, up by 3 points is Amira. Tram star ran in race number 71, who was 6 for long and finished on a notable second to watch my stride. Look at the runner, ridden hard, once watch my stride takes the charge from heart to toss and Moving significantly on the outside was Trumpstar was able to finish second up by three points. Next runner, we have Collateral Battle. Collateral Battle, I just want to say about this runner, where the jockey was called by the stripes. And Collateral Battle, committed warrior, overall Collateral Battle, rider stated that his instructions were to sit close and do his bet best in the straight, which he tried and until entering the straight. And thereafter, when asked for an effort, the horse shortened its strides and in the final 200 meters and dropped back. Number 5, Mind Reader. Number 7, Gusty Note. And number 10, Ibuck are the three runners. This is race number 87. Whereas Gusty Note was the long-time leader, this horse packed off and finished on 11th gets a drop of three points that's about gusty note whereas mind reader on the other hand ran in race number 87 gradually improved well to finish fifth but the winner being too good green tough winner of five lengths margin between the second third and fourth is just one and a quarter length whereas the other runner in race number 87 was ibug this horse totally ran out of board finishing ninth gets a drop of one point Number 6 is nearest. This is the late Cynthia Azura who ran in race number 67 over 7 for a long trip after finishing a decent third by 3 and a quarter length to green turf but here did not reproduce that run in the same class over same distance but finished on a far away ninth to Siavash. This was the first dead heat of the season where Siavash and Brisbane crossed the line together. Number 8 is Aluri Sprite. Race number 80. It ran in race number 80, finishing 7 to Kingston. Kingston having a commanding lead, but at the post it was cut to 3 fourths of a length by the fast finishing Lacros. But looking at the Aluri Sprite, earlier run, winner, 6 for long trip, got a penalty of 8 points, but did not show that kind of zest in running in this race, finishing 7th. Number 9 is Whiskey Martini. Almost all eight horses wide was Whiskey Martini. This is race number 77, which was won by different by a margin of two lengths. Close go for the miners. That was Mandela Bay and charging on the outside of the two runners. But still, Whiskey Martini, on the other hand, finished on six, gets a drop of two points. Look of Law ran in race number 88. Already having three runs this season. Finishing fifth in his past starting to Appenzel by nearly five lengths. Later on, race number 22, seven for long trip, five, five and a half, went up to seven for long, eight to Bisati, and again seven for long trip, fifth, but a distance behind the winner, maximum glamour, gets a drop of three points, is look of love. Number 12 in the car is Flamingo Fame, who ran in race number 96, over six for long. And when you look at the colors, royal blue, pink sleeves, ridden hard, but still the horse, did not gather momentum. One good run out of uh, five starts this season is where it finished on second in race number 75 by one and a half length to top in class but never reproducing those. That run in last two runs is Flamingo Fame gets a drop of three points.